What's up guys, it's your boy iPal here and today I'm here with, you know, this gameplay of no rules. I'm sorry, I really don't have anything. I do have like legit gameplay I could show you, but it's not really, I just wouldn't want to upload it to leave it like that. But I'm here today to talk about like the Storm 3 versus Storm art, like Storm 4 argument. A lot of videos have been posted about it. And when I mean a lot of videos, I mean mainly streams where it's been talked about, conversed about. I know uh, Qyon has a lot of streams. And I thought maybe you guys would want some of my input on why I moved, why I prefer, which game I prefer, etc., etc. The whole Storm 3 versus Storm 4 argument. And I'll just start out by saying I'm going to try to keep this. Um, debate or not this not debate at all it's not debate was the wrong word and by the way i'm sorry this is unscripted i'm just doing this because i just finished doing some college homework and you know i'm trying i've been trying to get a video out for a minute and um i'm gonna try to keep this video as unbiased as possible so as you guys can tell with the gameplay i've been posting recently my streams and everything like that i clearly support storm 4 or no storm 3 more than i support storm 4 and I have a lot of reasons for that and the main reason is due to the fact that I was not a fan of I was not a very I was not a very big fan of you know what the standards of being good in storm 4 were to compared to the the standards of what being good in storm 3 were and in storm 4 it, like i said it's i'm going to try to keep this as unbiased as possible because in my opinion both games are just as broken in their own way i think storm 4 and storm 3 are i mean storm 3 storm 3 definitely has more broken mechanics but because most of those mechanics are broken and then you can do something to counter something that's broken you can do something that's just as broken which then kind of makes the game just as balanced as storm 4 now cuz storm th storm 4 was definitely the most balanced storm that we've ever had but it, it was also broken in its own way as well every naruto game we've ever had is broken and that's just point blank period and i believe that the argument between storm 4 and storm 3 is kind of pointless about which one is more broken etc et so i believe it's i believe both of the arguments about which game is better which game is least broken than the other i believe the argument is retarded because again each one of them were broken in their own right so Let's go into Storm 4 about what is broken about Storm 4 and then I'll go into like things about like Storm 3 that are broken. So Storm 4 and in my opinion it's called Storm 4 in my opinion like I stated the standards of being good in that game did not sit well with me. I was not I was not sitting well with doing 35 jutsus a game and losing nothing from it. I was not a supporter of, and again, I'm going to go back over the general view of the game. I'm not going to go just with patch. I'm going back in the pre-patch as well. I was not a fan of combo glitching. Combo glitching was attack support on crap. And that is what really aggravated me with that. Because a lot of the times, Storm 4, in my opinion, is a hypocrite's game. Because a lot of the people... They complained about, say, Dash Cut and Tamari, but they're sitting over there having infinite chakra doing 70 jutsus a game. Exaggeration, sorry. But, like, you know, you get the point. They're sitting over there doing who knows how many jutsus, sending out support dashes just in case I counter. They didn't predict it. They didn't think. They just played on autopilot to get that. And it's a lot of things like that happen. And St Storm 4 is just, in my opinion, I call it the hypocrites game. Because... People sit there and they complained about Dash Cut and Tamari, but they didn't realize they had the same things as we did in a different version. Just like sending out Jutsus all the all the time allows you time to pressure me, and allows you time to get away from me, etc. It's your own version of Dash Cut and Tamari. It just may not be as pure as Dash Cut, and it just may not be as pure of a form as Dash Cut and Tamari uh, like really is. But it still is your own version of it. But, and then a lot of people, I didn't like how like players would be looked down upon. I didn't like how players would be looked down upon simply because the team looks OP. But if you did something like combo glitch all day or send jutsus all over the place and did support dashes, which was actually just as OP to do, it 
it was okay to do that because it looked cool. I didn't, I wasn't a fan of that. And then the le one of the very last things I think I'll go into talking about this with Storm for changing camera angles. Changing camera angles was one of the most irritating things to me in this game. Because what people did, everyone did the last Sasuke thing. You are, even I did that. And I did it just to, you know, see if I could do it. It, it, people would do Inferno style fireball jutsu, send out their support dash, and then it changes the camera angle completely. So my character does a 360 when I try to sidestep and dodge it. It doesn't block it. It does. I have to. I have to block it or sub it. I can't dodge it. I can't do anything about it. I have to block it or dodge it. Then uh, the last thing I will go into the very last thing about Storm Four, and now we're going to move into Storm Three because, like I said, I'm keeping this as less biased as possible. I stated that with Storm. Or uh, this one, what people would do, there were there are certain times in Storm 4 where you were forced to switch. You did not have a choice. <laughs> Cause I know and I'm not I'm not gonna call out any specific players. Because I believe that's uh, you know, be more professional than that. But certain players would do a dash cancel when two characters dash each other and the dash cancels out. Then they would switch and then they would start they would start hitting me because if I didn't switch, I couldn't do anything about it. I couldn't, I couldn't do a single thing about it. It didn't make sense to me. I just, I didn't understand it because I was just sitting there. I'm like, how is this fair to me? How is this fair to me? Like I have to, I'm forced to change the way I'm forced to change the way I play because you abuse this game mechanic in this way. And that's really it for Storm 3. I just didn't like the standards of what being good in Storm 3 were. Now let's move on to Storm, or I mean Storm 4, I kept saying Storm 3. Let's move on to Storm 4, 3. Now Storm 3, the standards of being good in this game are, you know, picking the best character in MASH, or as you see right here in the gameplay, unfortunately, and I will use it as a little bit of an example. Just playing the gayest things, period, you know, picking the gayest characters and you know abusing what they have like whether that be Nagato's sure attack as you see or Hanzo's tilt or Conan running and stuff there it's a lot of things wrong with Storm 3 just like there is Storm 4 and that is why I do believe my main claim here is that no one should be talking crap about whether they support Storm 4 more whether they support Storm 3 more both the games are retarded both the games are stupid and BS. It's a matter of which BS you prefer to put up with. I prefer to put up with Storm 3 BS due to the fact that we're more on the same page. We're more You're more on the same page with how you're playing in this game when it comes to playing at the highest level. You're, you're more on the same page. You're playing OP, I'm playing OP. And a lot of people talk about in Storm 4 how you know it offers a variety of options to catch you a variety of options to beat your opponent, etc., etc. That's great, but those options aren't that hard to do. Those options that are spoken about, like Storm 3, first hit dashing, not an easy thing to do if you know how to do it. It's not easy when you're first doing it. It's easy once you keep practicing and you keep learning, but it's not easy once you have, you know, once it's not easy. It's not an easy option. There's not a lot of options to get out of Storm 3 BS. Which also makes it, in that sense, take a little bit more skill, in my opinion. That's just me. And then, I know, like, one of my friends was talking about, you know, Storm 3 and Storm 4 and character, character stuff. Whole lot of which, he, you know, he was talking about, in Storm 4, you have to, you know, actually walk up and match with some characters. And then the argument that I had to that was due to the fact that, I mean, most of the Storm 3 character roster is busted. Most of them are OP as crap. And a lot of them are OP. So that, in that sense, makes it balanced because we're playing, like I said, on the same page. But mainly, like I said, because I, you know, I'm going to try and cut this off. Because I'm not trying to talk forever. But, and I really probably should have done the scripted. But I didn't. I'm sorry. I, I would have if I had the time. But other than that... Like I stated, um, well, this guy right here, Art of Puppetry, very good player. He's a no rules player. And this was from a first of 10 that me and him did. I I don't know how long ago that was. But other than that, I do 
prefer Storm 3 over Storm 4. And it's not because of I think Storm 4 or Storm 3 is a harder game to play. It's just like I stated, the argument between Storm 3 versus Storm 4 is kind of stupid. And it's just a matter which BS you feel like putting up more with. So this is iPal and <laughs> peace out. <laughs>